Snurgle, burgle, burgle, tickle, bum, ting. Snurgle, burgle, burgle, tickle, bum, ting. What's going on, everybody? And welcome back to a uh, heavy metal uh, news snack or a video autopsy, whatever you want, whatever you would like to call this. Uh, Fildy here, I saw an article that says he's going to be putting out new music with Stillwell, his band Stillwell. I didn't know that he was in a band called Stillwell, so I thought, ping, ding, dongs. We're going to check out a little live clip here of Stillwell and see what they sound like. I'd love for you to get in the comments below and tell me what you think of the band. It looked like he's playing a guitar here. It's not that funky, fresh bass that he's always playing, but nowadays, they you know, see, what they like to do is they put the bass strings. Now you can get six-string basses, eight-string this, that string. You know, it's like stick with six or four. Come on now. What are you? So master those before you start getting more of them. But I believe he's playing guitar in this band. Um, he hasn't been in corn for a while. Maybe this article will shed a little light on that. I've wondered what was going on with him because Fildy is, he's one of those dudes that you know from corn. I guess you know them all, right? Monkey Head, uh, Jonathan Davis, Fildy, and then whoever they have on drums at the time. But, uh, let's get into a little bit of this article, see what it says, and then we're going to get into a little still well. The song's called You Can't Stop Me, Honey Sister Child. So let's see what's going on with that. Uh, corn bassist Reginald Fildy Arvizu, Arvizu is returning to the to the world, but not with his main band Corn. Another thing I'll say is I noticed that some like 13 years ago, when I'm like, oh wow, this band's been around a long time, Corn put some of their video stuff up on the Corn YouTube channel, so they're totally down for it, right? With down for him to, you know, some bands don't like you to do side bands like James Hetfield. Uh, he's returning to the world, but not with his main band, Korn. Instead, Fildy has announced he'll be putting out new music with his band, Stillwell. On September 16th, you can check out a brief trailer for the single below, which doesn't really offer much in terms of actual music. Still, it's good to see Fildy getting back out there. Uh, I'm wondering what's going on with him and Korn's. Though this also poses the question of, well... When or if Fildy will be making his grand comeback with Corn? Who's playing bass for Corn? I know that um, uh, they had they. I did see like a show where Robert Trujillo of Metallica's son was playing bass for him, but uh, I'm not sure of that. Let's take a peeksy doodle at this. What's this? Well, they got nice outfits for sure. Stillwell rocks. That's what you do when you can't get stillwell.com or whatever. I bet you if there's a stillwell.com, it's uh, it's probably some kind of a, a, a water company, you know, like a water brand or a, some kind of stillwell. Joe, you know, get some refreshing stuff or whatever. Let's watch that one more time. What happened? Come on, Johnny. Come on, Johnny. Oh, they're just going to show you the, the audit. Let's check this out. 58 seconds in. You can't stop me. They're at the joint. So let's see what this is all about. Got kind of a funky groove to it. Yeah, he's playing guitar all right. You can't break me and you can't stop me. Band seems pretty tight. Living it up, you can't stop me. Living it up, wow. Drums sound great. That guy knows how to tune a snare. You know what I'll say about this too is it, it's 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 almost it's got kind of a groove sound to it, but I swear you could you man and maybe I'm wrong and please get in the comments below and say Shane horse shit that doesn't sound anything like it. But when you listen to that music, if this guy wasn't singing over it, it was Marilyn Manson going, "Oh yeah, I killed the man," uh, you know, you could almost kind of use that music for Marilyn Manson. Is that right or wrong? God, there's a big ass bug on my landed on me. That's it. He's 
still got to do that stance. He's filled it. He's got to get down there. Well, I like the way that drummer's playing. He's playing in the pocket there. I mean, what would you call this? This isn't like, uh, this is this is for, uh, this kind of music is not, they're not trying to be popular. They're not writing songs that have pop, you know, hooks so they can be the next, you know, Nickelback or the next Ghost or the next, you know. It's got a heavy funk groove to it. I like that drummer. That riff right there almost got a bit of a stoner vibe to it. And these guys look like a bunch of regular Joes, but that uh, that uh, uh, video, that little clip that they showed from Instagram, they were all dressed in outfits and stuff. I wonder if they're sprucing that up. Uh, uh, yeah. Probably he just wants to play more guitar and less bass. So if I was at this concert, you'd be seeing that. You can't stop me. Because they can see it from the audience. They can see these bobbling heads that aren't doing much of anything. But you'd see me out there and say, that, guy, that son of a gun right there, he's shaking, his, he's shaking what his mama made, gave him. Yeah, you end that with a little laugh there. <laughs> right? Bam! Big ending. Ah, so there you have that. Anything else here? Fieldy announced his hiatus from corn back in, in June of 2021 after falling back on some bad habits in the last six years. Corn's guitarist James Monkey Schaefer later revealed that Fieldy played on the band's latest album, Requiem, which is not too bad. I've listened to it, and it's not that it's not bad at all. Uh, and that's and that he's taking some time to kind of figure out what makes him happy. According to guitarist Brian Head Welch, Korn and Fieldy will reconvene after Korn wraps up their upcoming tour with Evanescence. We've been in contact with him, he said. I just emailed him the other day, so we're going to get together and talk to him, see how he's doing, see where his head is at after this tour. Me and Monk, uh, that's Monkey for short, uh, James Monkey Schaefer, uh, we're just talking about it. We love him. We've been in communication with him, and we'll see what happens. So there you have that. Uh, Stillwell. That didn't sound too bad to me, but I'd love for you to get in the comments below and tell me what you think of Stillwell, if there's any music I might want to check out. I had no clue that he was ever in a band, but apparently he's been with these guys for at least, well, 13 years uh, is when they put up the uh, the uh, official video for Stillwell on the Corn page. But what say you? Get in the comments below and tell me what you think of Stillwell. Tell me what you think. Do you think Phil they should come back? Um, he's probably coming back. I love that when bands, everyone goes through shit in their lives. And I love it when bands go, hey, we'll give him a break. Give him the time. But he's always got an open spot here. Instead of kicking him to the curb and going, I'll never do anything with that guy again. You know, screw him. I like when they go, well, you know, he's he's a brother, and, and uh, he was in the band from the very beginning, so when he decides, and if he decides to come back, then we will welcome him with, uh, with open arms. So get in those comments and tell me what you think of that. Oh, Lordy, boom, down, you can't stop me. Oh, honey child, you can't stop me. Oh, baby girl, can't stop me. Can't stop me, baby girl.